Hello, Gemini, and welcome to your um, tarot card reading for the week of September um, 19th. Let's see what's coming up for you guys. Okay. 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 All right. We got some people here. Looks like you know we meeting new people. Anyway, let's get on with your reading here. You got some um money cards. Creativity. Always thinking, doing things. So anyway, let's get into your reading here. Um, you're coming in with the queen, uh, uh, king of spades. And you don't have the queen of snow. Okay, but since I said queen of um, uh, spades too, so you know what? There's an additional person there. In addition, so it's just telling me a lot out. Like I see, a lot of people becoming in focus this week. Well, the King of Spades is telling me that um, some of you are focused on your career or um, really on trying to um, find some details in some in some paperwork or something that's important when it's got to do with work or um, some kind of ideas. It could be a legal issue. I'm not sure about that. But it also says that um, a um, person could you know, I think it could be prop, uh, connected with work, could have come in prominently, was coming in prominently too. Um, you got the 10 of diamonds and I'm telling, and it's telling me again that some of you, the feel I get for you guys is, um, some of you are focused on career work, um, money and trying to, um, work out some kind of details, but this is, this is good. It is coming to some kind of, um, close and, um, for, for others, this is, um, this is your current situation is saying, you know, money's, um, it could be possibly coming in or some investments is going to be very fruitful late, later. So it depends. The only thing that is, um, like I said, um, hindering you here is the seven of spades. That again is telling me it's trying to find some details in some kind of areas. It could be some mm, trying to find some answers in your career or um, at work or some documents or something. And you're trying to find the details in it or, you know, um, the, you know, how they say the devil's in the details. It's pretty much simple, but it's just trying to find it. Um, again, so it's kind of a little bit of a struggle here trying to, um, mentally process some stuff. That's what's coming up. That's what's kind of hindering this here. Um, what's crowning your reading is the four of hearts and the four of hearts again is talking about home. Um, also that some of you could be, um, like I said, there's some kind of, um, trying to find answers to some stuff is what's coming up in this reading. And it could be in matters of the heart too, things that are important to you, home, um, or trying to like communicate and uh, find some answers into some puzzling situations that's coming up for some of you too. For some of you, it could show a little bit of boredom, or it also is showing that um, trying to uh, bring in some creativity. And there are creative cards here too, because here you're coming in with the queen of clubs, and this is saying tap into your creativity. Um, then things will uh, like kind of fall into place anyway. Um, so tap into your creativity. That's what it's showing here. Um, that's coming in and you got the um, five of hearts. Again, this is saying that there could be some feeling, some kind of disappointment in some areas. Um, it could be, um, or, you know, <laughs> this it's, it's like crying over spalt milk too. So it's like, um, just trying to get the answers to something. That's what it's coming up very powerful for some of you here. So that's why I'm going to keep using that word. Um, then you get the Jack of hearts and the Jack of hearts is telling me, um, new friends, um, uh, coming in, um, great, um, creative ideas will, uh, benefit you. You know, they'll come in, um, and, um, bring attention. Some of you, this could be a love interest coming in. That's just for some of you. This is also, um, um, meeting new friends and, 
being with people that you like and um, being invited to some parties or and hearing good news. So I like this card too. And the six of um, uh, spades here is saying that some of you may be traveling. And this also could be saying that um, you'd be, you know, you'll get the answers to some of this stuff. And, um, um, and actually, if you get it from someone, you, uh, from unlikely sources, people that you haven't talked to before either, you know, just for a while or just an acquaintance, just listen around. When you have people in your cards, messages are, you should be hitting some messages from it too. So, you know, and then walking away from um, a situation, you know, it's like it's, it's done. Then you are leaving with the seven of diamonds. And that again is saying there could be some indecisions or um, decisions where to, it's to make some kind of decision. So you're going to be um, deciding or trying to make decisions of where to, um, where you're going to put all your eggs in one basket or, you know, that kind of message. Um, the overall energy underlining is the, jack of spades and he is in reverse so it's just saying that you know you could be going through this kind of um stall uh, where you're trying to find an answer to something or um focusing so much on career or you know um, the doubles in the details like i said <laughs> um it's just it's you're just um, struggling a little bit in that area and it's just saying that um it's just not processing as fast as you want it to but um sure enough you know the jack of spades always moves pretty fast so that's kind of what's happening here. At the same time, this could be um, uh, hearing some, um, being careful about, you know, because you got a lot of friends here and a lot of them are good, but this could be just someone that may be coming in from the past or that, that maybe um, you should a little bit be, be, keep a little distance on because um, they could be bringing in um, negative, negative energy or just making, just say something stupid. They'll just, you know, kind of get you mad. <laughs> that's the best way to put it. So that's another way that could be. And let me pull another tarot card to see, to add to the reading. Okay. The queen of wands tap into your creativity. Okay. So, you know, you're with your, it's telling me the answers come with your creative thoughts. So, Tap into your creative creativity, and you're going to make things move. Um, you got both of them here too. So um, also, it could figure prominently for the week and be very useful and helpful. And this could be a new friend coming in too with these qualities, and that could be very helpful. But I think it's also saying your creativity is on high, confidence, and um, the doubles in the details. Wherever it is, you're gonna your creates your creative intelligence, and that will. Um, Bring those answers through whatever that was the main message here so that's going to resonate with some not with all but i only speak what it's you know when you're looking for millions of gemini's out there anyway um that was your reading gemini for the week of uh, september 19th please like share and subscribe and um catch you tomorrow for my regular gemstone and woodstone readings bye guys